Well, hi there, you wonderful and lovable YouTubers. I have a, a magic trick that I'm actually going to show everyone. It is uh, very simple. You can learn how to do this pretty quickly. And I've got a deck of cards right here. It's a regular deck of cards. The trick, I will show you how to do it. I have a... There's my phone. It's a regular deck of cards. Um, totally. 52 card deck. Uh, nothing marked or anything. I can't really prove that, obviously. But, anyways, it is, well, here's the box. <laughs> Made in China, if that tells you anything. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Anyways, I'm going to show you a nice little trick right here. You can do this with, uh, anybody. Most people will fall for it. In fact, it's, it's very good if you set it up right. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to shuffle the deck up completely randomly. What you do in the real life situation with a person who you're doing the trick on is you'd let them shuffle the deck up and pick a random card out. Okay, so right here I'm going to shuffle the deck up. I'm not looking at it. Eyes are closed. You can see that. I'm trying, uh, okay. I'm just going to shuffle it up a little bit. Okay, now what you're going to do is, uh, get them to pick a random card out. I'm going to go with this one. You're going to tell the person to put it on the top of the deck. And then what you're going to do is you're going to take the deck, put it behind your back, and tell them you're going to shuffle it. Okay? You're going to make it look like you're shuffling it a bit. And then you're going to um, turn the deck around. Okay? Do that. Put it back behind you. Shuffle it a little more. Um, and then you're going to tell them, for good measure, you shuffle it. You let them shuffle it, um, which is a nice little trick. They shuffle it a bit. Um, then you take the deck from them. You look through the deck and say something like, uh, uh, "You know, I'm trying to I, I'm trying to feel for this card. I'm going to use my psychic powers and I'm, I'm trying to feel this. Maybe I might get an energy uh, impression by running my hands through it." And uh, you know, I, I don't know. I'm not really getting it right now. And uh, what you'll do then, you'll say you're not really getting it. You'll you could put it in your coat pocket or something. Like right here, I put this deck in my coat pocket. You'll say, now I'm going to try and move my hands through here. I can't really see the deck, so maybe the energy will flow better. Okay, and you get close to them and let them listen to your coat as you shuffle through the cords. Hope you can hear that. Okay, then you say, oh, I've got it. And then you flip the card out. <laughs> And uh, it's a very simple trick once you know how to do it. All you do is when you hand them the deck, they look through it, put the card they pick at the top of the deck. It's at the top. Oh, and by the way, it's that. I haven't seen it. You put it back behind your deck and tell them you're going to shuffle it. You put it behind you and tell them you're going to shuffle it. And you turn it around. And what you've done is you've flipped it around behind your back. So that you can see the card. So when you turn it around like this, it's the Queen of Spades. Put it back behind your back. Make sure they can't see that you flip it around. You flip it back over and shuffle it. And then you tell them to shuffle it. They go through it. They see. You can even let them make sure their cards in there. Make you know prove that. And uh, you get the card. I mean, once they've shuffled it and handed it back to you, you get the card. Put it at the top of the deck or the bottom, depending on what you want to do. Uh, it really doesn't matter. And then what you'll do is you'll put it in your coat pocket, and as you do that, you move your hands through the deck like, like that. You pull the card out whenever you feel ready. There's another way to do this. You could actually, um, <clears throat> once, uh, well, actually, that's another trick I was thinking about. But, yeah, that's how you do that trick. You can stick it in their pocket or something. That might freak them out a little more. You can do all kinds of things with it. Get creative. It's a very simple trick, something easy to learn, easy to amaze people with, and have fun with it, okay? <laughs> <laughs>